The reflections in this game are really good. I don't think I mentioned that. Open doorway. Hello? Oh, cool. Okay, I'll be right with you, Eva. Hold on. Dear all oh, the light. When they cheated us during the food distribution, that should have been the last straw. I was naive to think that they could still be reasoned with. I don't think anyone has any more doubts. We strike at noon. Remember, these people no longer resemble the people you once knew. He's brainwashed them. Don't pity them. They wouldn't afford you the same kindness. Uh-oh, sounds like the Polish freedom fighters are about to start fighting. But uh, not for freedom. What's up? Hey, I was getting lonely. Oh, so I'm I sorry. I'd call you. I hope you don't mind. Eva. Did you say your name was Eva? Eva, Eva. I'm yes, sorry. That's right. Eva. So you have the same name as that thing. What thing? Could you please not compare me to a Oh, the computer. <laughs> Besides, Eva is spelled E W A. Not E V E. E V E isn't pronounced Eva. I thought we agreed it's to Eve. trust each other. Unless you're Wally. Eva? No, I do trust I you. I trust you. I'm sorry. I'm just saying you idea. have a similar name to the each computer. Of us says something about themselves. Something personal. Oh, icebreakers. Love icebreakers. But I spent most of my life living in a small village in the mountains. My dad is sort of a pastor i was always really impressed by how he <gasps> managed to line. inspire his people but i never got to meet my mom oh your turn well we met our Remember mom and never met our dad personal. uh <sighs> my mom passed away recently oh i'm sorry to hear or that or we I don't remember I what I just said, but it's we've never met our dad. Did he know your mom? I think so. I think the man in the picture is our I dad. Understand now. Thank but you for I guess we'll find that. out. It couldn't have been easy. I should keep going. Right. Thanks for the chat, Shimon. Talk My light later. is off center and it is bugging me. I'm blind, but I feel much better. Alright. Eva. Did I already forget how to pronounce it? It's like... It was Eva, right? Ev I'm sorry. Eva. E I remember there was two ways to pronounce it. I was pronouncing it wrong, and then she said it, and I corrected myself. But I've already forgotten which was which. As a matter of fact, I can't even remember what the second pronunciation is, and if it was the right one or the wrong one. I'm so hopeless with names. I remember faces really well. I'm not very good with names. This is locked. I just walked in a circle. Uh, anyway, through here? Nope. Nope. Shimon, stop breathing like that. Keep breathing, but stop breathing like that. Is there a way forward in here that I missed? Because, uh, otherwise I have to backtrack. Oh, yes, here we go. Alright. Up we go! Aha! Uh -huh, a memory tube. Alright. Got another computer back here. There are quite a few of these. Memory tube. Can you let me out of here? Sure, just give me a second to find you on the monitors. Awesome, thank you. I found another Eve memory tube. We don't need to play it. The system doesn't seem to require it. But I want to play it. I want to learn. I want to know about this Why stuff. Why would you want to? 
Has anything good come from digging up the past? Oh, come on. It's not so like it's gonna hurt it anything. Opens stories of destruction and betrayal. That's true, but I want to know about these I stories of destruction and dis betrayal. Oh, right, we saw his picture. Lucian is the man we're looking for. Duh. You know my opinion, do what you want. <sighs> I want to play it. I want to play it. Yes, I do. I can't stop you, can I? Nope. Yeah, there was a... It found Lucian in the database, and there was a picture of him, and it was clearly the man in the photo. I don't know how I didn't register that. So Lucian is the man in the photo. Hopefully he's not our dad, then. This dude seems to suck, as far as I'm concerned. Oh boy, he's got a host again. At this rate, we should be able to leave the bunker in a couple of months. That is, if we choose. Incoming huh? call. Dominico Wasi Wicks. Wait, is she using a computer? Lucian, we need to talk. Well, this certainly is a surprise. To what do I owe the pleasure, Dominica? Dominica. I want to negotiate. No. As I've already told you, the situation is simple. We split the food three ways. Three ways. You get a third, we get a third, and the rest will be given as an offering to the gods. You're giving away a third if of your food as an for offering their guidance, to the gods. We wouldn't have found the food to begin with. We must pay our respects. You are Fine. crazy, man. Fine. We'll split the food three ways. But on one condition, you take down those turrets. I'll take them down. Eventually. He's controlling turrets. If you turrets, keep your end uh... of the bargain for the next two months, then I'll agree to remove them. Yeah, when we can think of it as a grace period. If you want production to continue, then you need to take them down now. Oh, does she control the food source? The thing is, Dominica. I need you less than you might think. This thing has gone. F this come guy has gone from you've shy scientist. Well, not shy, but wait. Uncertain. Let's not make any to, hasty uh, decisions. Deranged. I'm sure we can come to an understanding, Lucian. Warning: security breach detected. What's happening? He muted. This is like a Discord call. Deactivated. She tricked us. I don't know what you're. You'll find out soon enough. But I can promise, this won't end well for you. Find her! <laughs> Warrant request for Dominica Wasiewicz. Get those Wasi turrets back online Wicks. quickly. Activating security turrets. Inhabitant located. Show me the map. She disabled They're the turrets and is storming them. Good they riddance. Must get across the bridge to this the dude's bunker. insane. What the hell? Hold them back. Enable traffic control. Okay. Close gate. Scanning for weapons. Warning. Blunt weapons detected. Threat level is high. Close another gate. It's not working. We have to blow it out. We have to blow up the bridge. Do you, you understand? Blow up the bridge with all those There's people no on it? Other way. If we don't, all of this will have been for nothing. Why? Because they won't let you sacrifice your their food to a god. The turrets are back online. Authorize the use of lethal force. Make sure no one's on the bridge when it explodes. Yeah, because you kill them all? Warning, there are 14 civilians in the line of fire. Use of lethal force? No. Not authorized. What have you done? You still don't understand how any of this works, do you? Not by your standards, no. 43 colonists detected. Manual I didn't override want detected. This. I didn't want any of this. No, you just wanted to shoot them all with turrets and then blow up the bridge. You made me do this. Shut up, you idiot. No. You made me do this. You are a monster. A deranged monster. 23 casualties, 19 critically injured. What the hell, dude? I love how fools can only know how to deflect blame. Right is always right.
Well, that was an experience. I really hope this guy is not our dad. Please just let him be someone else who somehow was with our mother in that picture. I really don't see any other way this can go, though, so I better learn to accept it. Oh, look, it's the bridge that he blew up. There are the turrets. Oh, it looks like I can still get across here. Oh, come on. I could just jog across that, please. You refer to yourself as boy? Okay. You do you, Shimon. <laughs> now I call him Shimon instead of Kid, too. I don't know. I still feel like I could call him Kid. I'm so jaded. What the heck, man? I also realize it looks kind of weird that... Interesting. That I, uh, I have, like, my personal light on for myself. But then I turned off the room light, which I've always had on in all my other recordings until last one where I made to be defense. And I mostly just did that because there was no point in highlighting the rest of the room and it was putting like a bunch of light reflections on my hair because I have thick flat hair. So no matter how clean and unoily it is, it reflects the light like crazy. And it was just annoying me so much, so I just got rid of it. Just turned the light off. Can I get through here? Yes, I can. Awesome. It does look a little weird, like I'm coming out of a ghost story or something, but... <laughs> It's fine. You guys can see me, right? I assume you want to see me. Of course, that's what you're here for, right? <laughs> In all honesty, I wouldn't mind otherwise. I tend to like... I like the games to speak for themselves. I don't want it to be like my commentary with the game in the background. I want it to be the game with my commentary in the background. I'm pre Like, the game is the art that we're here to appreciate. That's yeah, just my opinion, though. I, I get that a lot of people don't agree with that, and that's totally fine. Whatever entertains you, that's the whole point. Ugh. I like how I say that in the video that I've probably been talking by far the most during. I have so much pent up things to say because I had nothing to say during Dear Esther and What Remains of Edith Finch. Those two games, I was. I was speechless throughout most of the time. Transcription of an automatic recording triggered by detection of the keyword GOAT via the intercom system. Zofia Nabagloa, that GOAT, there was something odd about it. Aloisi Nab Nabaglo. Nabaglo and Nabaglo. Loa. Anyways. What do you mean, odd? Had horns, a tail, a goat like any other. But did you see what it did? goat things stood around exactly stood in the grass and didn't even take a bite maybe it wasn't hungry Aloisa have you heard have you ever seen a goat that wasn't hungry that's like a calf with two heads don't you remember how in 43 the Slaz Slaketsk goat ate all our gra the grass in our yard then ate your belt too and you had to trust your trousers up with twine don't act like you don't know go don't know goats never stop eating I'm telling you something with the goat ain't right well, it's a miracle goat. Maybe miracle goats are more particular about what they eat. You old fool, you believe anything. If some pretty young thing lifted her skirt for you, you'd think it was for true love and not the six pounds of dried meat in the larder. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, call the tiger by the toe, if you all the... Let's click this button first. Okay, that opened them. This shuts them all. What does this do? Does that lock them? Oh, that opened the door in the back, I see. Well, I guess we'll open these. Why not? Oh, they do block the way off. Okay. Where do I get down from? I think I get down all the way in the back there. You guys can't see where I'm pointing, but all the way in the back there. So I think this is fine. Hey Eva, 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 
Yes, Eva, I think. What are you? It looks like a food processing factory. I can't. Eva? Eva. Eva. I was saying it right. Yay. Okay, uh, she seems to have some sort of very poor connection to here. So, I guess we're not getting much more conversation out of her right now. Thank you very much. Can I drop here? That seems like a bad idea. Yeah, I can. Okay. I can drop here. Yeah, so I was right. It's um, it's past all the gates that are blocking the way off. Ah! Ooh, I don't think it mattered. <sighs> Stop, the Stop. Stop the machine. Stop the machine. Stop the machine. Stop the machine. We are not ground meat now. Thank you very much, Eva. Thank you. Fast reactions. Oh, that sounds disgusting. I'm so glad we did not go through that. Where was the microphone she was hearing us from? I guess there was probably one somewhere. If you yell loud enough. Oh, another computer. Thank you. Eva? Can you hear me? Uh, I thought I was going to die. I need to tell you something. You saved my life, and not just now. When my mom passed away, I didn't think I could carry it alone. Oh. There was no one, nothing left for me to live for. I tried looking for Lucian because I needed someone to be there for me. That someone was you, not him. I have a goal now. Aww. I'm going to find you. Someone's great. Yeah, screw Lucian, you don't need him. Alright. Yeah, you get that, that near death. Um, <laughs> of new understanding or new appreciation of the world. Stenographic rec record request letter. According to the settlement office, we are to be supplied with 200 tons of spelt no later than March 1st, 1960. No such delivery has been made thus far. This is an urgent matter. I expect a prompt response. Response. Your request has been noted. The delay is due to the unfathomable stupidity of Polish bandits. They want to blow up an SS outpost, but their explosives exploded prematurely, destroying a nearby storage facility that was holding spelt meant for Zolzendorf. We will supply you with spelt as soon as possible. Back in the garbage with you. Right is always right. Looks like it makes no difference. There's nothing here. I guess I'll check out the left. But left cannot be right. Right is always right. Oh, that's locked. Can I open it from the other side still? Yes, I can. Alright, left is wrong. Do not let left be right. Right is right. Yep, nothing here either. Guess it doesn't matter. Whoop. Okay. Right is always right. Ah, oh, what is that noise? Let's go ahead and open up the other door anyways. Just because I can. Oh, but I gotta open both these doors from this side anyways. Oh, the completion is OCD inside me since I must backtrack and open this door. So I shall. a lot better. Just you, you just gotta have them all open. No particular reason, but they just need they need to be open. What's this? Well that's a pretty drawing. What do we got here? People have gone completely effing nuts with this whole faith of the ancestors thing. They want to make sacrifices. We don't have enough food to just be tossing it away so the gods may feast. 
I think I need to think of something that will satisfy the gods, but keep the offering intact. There has to be a fire, otherwise they won't buy it. And when would I throw something on it? The flames should spurt up. Maybe some kind of LED thing? I think I saw some lights somewhere. Just have to keep the dolts away from the sacrificial fire or they'll catch on. The hallowed tree should be a good spot for making sacrifices. There needs to be a hole behind the fire with a photovoltaic vault cell hooked up to a circuit so it sends an impulse that increases the flame. Underneath there can be a container for the so sacrifices which will go right back to the storehouse. Damn, if I'd known I'd end up being forced to meddle with electronics, I'd never have decided to become a priest. Wait, was that Lucian? Or was that something else? Hmm. Open says me. That's a heavy looking door. Let me just squeeze by there. Ooh. Depression. Sir, this came out in time of Gen Z. You don't need to tell us. <laughs> huh. Number four! Number yes, four. sir! This is where your labs are supposed to be. Labs? I knew you'd make it. Eva? Yes, I'm here if you need me. Yay! Oh, wait. What's this? How are you talking through this? Oh. What do you mean? It looks like a portable camera. That's so cool. Now I'll be able to see everything wait, you see. Wait, wait. That thing had the little can little clamp on it. Was yeah, that the... I can, but... That was I the thing that there was a graph number. of in the way beginning on that table. Electrical panel connected to it. Huh. Attention to detail is good. I appreciate it a lot. The electrical panel should be connected to the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I'm looking around. Hold on. Attention, Chief Commander of Military Colonies. Top secret. If a civilian commandment A demonstrates incompetence, endangers the completion of the EVE project, leads the colony into disarray, or places its continued existence in danger, fails to meet production quotas for three executive months, B. Exhibits signs of incapacity, mental or physical illness, rendering him incapable of performing his duties. He must be eliminated and a replacement chosen. Wow. Hail Hitler, Reichsfuhrer SS Henrich Himmler. Not extreme at all, no sir. Alright, we're looking for a serial number on an electrical panel connected to the door. I guess it's through here. The elevator stuck. I think it's the same one that you took before. Oh. If it hadn't broken down, I might never have found you. Well then, I'm glad it broke down. <laughs> okay, so we got the door here. Electrical panel? Aha. Hold still. I have to type it in. Okay, got it. It should be open hey. now. We're unstoppable. Yes, we are. That was strangely solemn, though. By the way, I heard everything is up down there in that photo processing place. I don't mind. I just wanted to tell you that I understand. I know what it's like to be left alone. Things stop making sense and you think everything's hopeless, but you have to keep going. Especially now, when we are so close. The control room is somewhere on this level. All right. Damn, we've already got we've passed two hours. That's okay. I'm pretty sure Ooh. that's not the way. I guess not. All right. Just gonna squeeze through here. Ooh, that's tight. I'm not sure. Are those the labs? An adult could fit through there. Like a prison to me. So, this is where they kept the criminals. I don't seem to have any control over this place. It's oh, that's good to know. It's much 
much older than anything else around here. It's not even connected to the mainframe. Huh. You know a lot about this stuff. Yeah. Well, I have a lot of time on my hands just sitting here. How long have you been sitting here? She must have some form of sustenance. And again, everything down here is green and wet and alive. It's kind of unnerving, honestly. What's this? What do we got in here? Nothing. Well, that was a waste of time. Are all of these doors locked? I can see things in there I can interact with. Okay, they're all locked, so there's gotta be- oh. Probably that. Yeah, that would be the door forward. I don't want to go there yet. I want to get these open. Have a look around. Whew. Okay. Each matron taken. Hold on, let me read it. Who? Hold on, let me read it. So, if we want to go downstairs, we'll have to find an unused punch card. Try opening up the cells. I'm working on that, Eva. 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 <clears throat> Each matron taking part in the Quell their intelligence program will be granted a one-use punch card for good behavior. A one-use punch card can be exchanged for a visit to the first floor of the complex. Good behavior merits can be gained by abiding by the following rules. 1. Curfew. Matrons may not leave their rooms between 2100 and 630. That would be... Uh... 9 p.m. and 6.30 a.m. Hygiene. Matrons are required to maintain good personal hygiene. Cleanliness will be monitored by the superintendent. Medicine intake. Each matron will be prescribed a course of medication by their attending physician. Matrons must follow the medication intake as instructed. Nutrition. Matrons are required to eat all of the food that is brought to them by the superintendent. The above mentioned rules are subject to change by the attending physician. Not abiding by the instructions of the attending physician may be punishable by death. Hold the phone, dude. Okay, so this is literally a prison for mothers to give birth and raise children. And these are your rules? That's creepy as heck, dude. What does ah, this the mean? light. That the prisoners who are kept here were all fertile women. Why? I don't know. Dear Professor, as a specialist in the field of dentistry, I would like to turn your attention to the teeth-related aspects of your program. Research has shown over 90% of Polish women suffer from tooth decay and other dental diseases, negatively affecting their reproductive capacity. Dental diseases delay the onset of pregnancy and are a significant factor in miscarriages and low birth rate. Wait. Oral hygiene must be meticulously maintained during pregnancy. Bile spat up during morning sickness destroys enamel. Women must rinse their mouths with water after each expulsion. I suggest each woman admitted to the program undergoes full dental treatment before being, being sent to the farm. Once there, they must be supplied with oral hygiene supplies and supervised in their use. Hail Hitler, Hopstermuff, Hopstermfuhrer, Dr. Willie Frank, dental consultant. What the... Hell. Blah, blah, blah. This is kind of gross. So they have a farm for fertile women. It seems Polish women, but aren't they obsessed with like <laughs> pure genes or something? Let's go the punch card and get out of here. No. I think we should pay respect to the stories of these women. I don't want their sacrifice to be forgotten. Fair enough, I agree. <laughs> This, these cells, they have a bunk bed. So two of them li lived in these cells and were on curfew. That's disturbing. Look, this one hasn't been used at all. We could leave now. The women here were only allowed to go downstairs a couple of times. And this woman never even used her pass. Why? So was the three punches on the left three uses for good behavior, and the one on the right was punches of, uh, used up? Uses? I don't know. Why would they want to go downstairs anyways? What's down there? 
Okay. <clears throat> day three. It is my third day here, and still I marvel at the conditions in this place. How Everything is clinging is to a point of sterility. The prison seems like a better option. Hold on, Eva. I'm I'm reading. Eva. Everything is clinging to a point of sterility. The Germans treat us with a measure of politeness, and the food is fantastic. I have never eaten such frequent, delicious, filling meals. Plus, they they see we get enough physical activity and maintain proper hygiene. They even make sure we brush our teeth after every meal. Before I was brought here, they subjected me to every medical examination imaginable. It would all be like a wonderful vacation, except I still do not know where I am, nor why I am here, and I have no one to talk to about it all. I share my room with Stefa, but as soon as we enter it, she begins crying into her pillow. I try to speak to other girls in the cafeteria, but they only point to the walls with an uneasy look in their eye. Is someone eavesdropping? It seems I will have to survive a while longer without conversation. At least I have you, dear diary. You know what's more lonely than being alone? Being surrounded by people but unable to connect with any of them. Oh look, this one's all used up. This one is used up. Yes it is. Anything else in here? Damn, this place is really overgrown. How the heck did all this growth get in here? Alright, three rooms left. That's a lot of crossword puzzles. I was looking at a toilet, Ella. Okay. A four letter word for heaven it's not. Hell. Hell. That's it. Easy. Damn, even the crossword puzzles here are. Depressing. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. A four letter word for heaven it's not. Wait, we already did that. Hell. That's it. I broke the game, yeah, folks. I break every game. Paintings. What about them? My mom used to draw something like that. It's probably just a coincidence. Uh-oh. There's no way it's coincidence. Chekhov's gun and all that. Stupid lock of hair. This is a bad time for me to be getting distracted. Dear... Suava? Swa Su oh, that's pronounced that's Suava. That's my name. She was one of the prisoners. Why did she never mention it to me? Oh. But do you want to talk about this place? No, but that's kind of a big deal. I am forever grateful for what you did for me. He looks exactly how I remember him. I was terrified when I realized that I was starting to forget him, but now, thanks to you, I don't have to worry anymore. He'll always be with me. I'm writing this to you because I know you don't like to talk about it, but I hope one day you'll also get to experience what it means to be a mother. Those brief moments that we share with our child make all the suffering we go through worthwhile. I am praying to any god that is listening that they bless you with a child. Yours, Zosia. Is it a blessing to have a child under these circumstances in this place? I mean, I guess whatever helps you feel better about it all. Then again, introducing a child to this world seems kind of cruel. Here's another one. What? Another punch card? All used up? Looks like it's all used up. So that I with a line in it says, it, it works like a Y? Suava? No, that's a W, Suava. Alright, punch it, Chewie. And I give it back. Now oh, whatever. I'm glad that's over. Wait, that tree? It looks familiar. This one? It was on the back of the other elevator, too. Whoa! <laughs> My shadow is just... Hey, I, I appreciate that the head actually moves when I... Oh. The head actually moves when I move the mouse. Oh, the whole body moves. <laughs> okay. 
This is it? This is what they were denied? The right to meet their own children? You know what? I've tried to be brave, but this is too much for me. Call for me when you're out of there. Oh my god. So they were kept on the second floor and their children were kept down here? And they had to earn the right to come and see them? What the flippin' hell? Are these the delivery beds? This is so wrong and disturbing. Or I should say disturbingly wrong. But both of those worked. Oh no, that's... That's just awful. Ugh. Instructions concerning the selection of children in the Quelder Intelligence Program. Children involved in the program must first pass a rigorous selection process. As a first step, children with Aryan traits should be identified. They will be passed to real German families, or, once the program is underway, to the colonists. The remaining children should, by the time they are five years old at the latest, be split into three groups. A. Those with above average intelligence, as measured by the DISC, DISC, Dutch Intelligenzskala für Kinder, sorry, subjected to programming. B. Those with normal intelligence, prepared for field labor or factory work. C. Those with any manner, those in any manner retarded, placed in the T4 program. Note, point C does not apply to autistic children. They are difficult to manage, but score impressively in testing. Okay. I understand why Eva does not want to uh, observe this anymore. Right. Ain't this lovely. Okay, the darker it gets outside, the more and more messed up the background gets here because I have my light off. Would it be better if I turned it on? But the reflections on my hair. I'm being so picky. First world problems. It's fine. You guys can see me fine, right? Right. <sighs> uh, to Oberdenschleiter Max Pfeiffer, acting civilian commandment of Jesselschaft Shelter. I wish to inform you that Ulrika Haas, one of our educators, has grown louder in expressing her discontent with the conditions at our school. She feels that cozy environments, exquisite food, learning through play, frequent physical activity, ample leisure time, and steady art medicinal care should not be wasted on Slavic swine. She complains that her own children, Aryans, who can trace their heritage back at least seven generations, live much more modestly and without such extensive pedagog... Ped pedag Pedagogical, pedagogical aids. I, whoops, I don't know how to pronounce that either, and that's just normal English. My bad. Furthermore, their education is frequently interrupted by the need to take shelter from enemy bombing raids. Dr. Hans Fu... 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 <laughs> I kind of want to pronounce that differently. Director of Upbringing. They have a lot of directors for a lot of things here. Anything back here? Don't think so. Okay, well... Why does that water look so weird? I think this is the way out. From the looks of it, the control room should be just beyond the dam. If that's the way out, then I want to go the other way first. This. Eva? Yes? Could you open the door for me like you did before? Are you sure you want me to do that? Why not? Not in this place. It can be anything. Yes, no, I, 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 I want to know. I want to know. Okay, then. I'm sorry. I understand. Uh, I'm already changing my mind. What is this? They... They were inseminating women here. 
It's horrible. I knew coming in here was a bad idea. Yeah, yeah, you know what? I'm with you. I'm out. That's just lovely. A classroom? Yes, I'm sure they were being taught the best of things. Dear sir, I wish to call to attention a matter which I believe is of the utmost importance to the program you oversee. Cutting-edge research by Helga Goebbels indicates teaching children to play musical instruments has a very positive effect on their intelligence, particularly their linguistic ability and spatial perception. I guess that's why I'm an idiot, because I don't know how to play any instruments. This research's findings and methodology can be found in Helga Goebbels' fascinating doctoral dissertation, written by the young woman under the tutelage of my husband and soon to be defended. Thus, out of concern for the proper mental development of our young colonists, I ask that a grand piano be included in the colony's supplies, for such an instrument provides the best way to practice one's scales and thus enter the broader musical world. My husband is a fervent pro proponent of this idea. Hail Hitler, Ruth Sonnenbrock Hartman. Hyphen Hartman, if I must pronounce that all. Teddy bear, that's uh, that's a drawing of an atomic bomb exploding. What are you teaching these kids? Why is my hair going everywhere? Can you teach me that? I would like to know that much. All right, onward we go. It's never easy, is it? We'll have to find a way around. Of course, never is easy. You are so correct. There's always something broken and we have to take another path. Why can't the secondary path be broken and the convenient path be fixed? It's the bad looping ladder animation. Thankfully, that was very short. Okay. How the heck did Eva get all the way down here? That's pretty pretty. It's very loud too, though. I need to stop biting my lips. Promptly does it again. I... I grew up here. Oh. Didn't you say that you grew up in the village in the mountains? I did. And you thought this was it? Shuma, this isn't funny. What is going on here? I don't know. Aha, uh -huh, the plot thickens. So she thought she grew up in a village in the mountains, sure but it was actually this? It is. Well, at least I think it is. I don't know what to believe anymore. How bizarre. Oh, mighty Veles, old Mrs. I don't know if that's Miss, Mrs. or whatever. Plasnik begrudged you a sacrifice. I heard her say it. I told her husband he was a fool to give you meat. Why not old bread if we not if we got to give something? She said. Anyways, she only gives anything so people don't call her cheap. So please, mighty Velas, punish her like she deserves, and reward me, your faithful servant, always looking after you with health, good fortune, and that ring off the red with the red gem, Mrs. Pia. P.S. Nick got off that German woman and surely does not deserve. Brilliant English, sir. Truly an educated man. Also, why the heck would you call on a god to punish someone for... You are just a selfish bastard, aren't you? And what's here? This is where we used to gather. My father performed rituals at that altar. Yeah, she said her foster father was like a pastor. Is he the one who wrote that note about, like, becoming a priest? I keep looking at my record- my secondary monitor recording me when I should be looking at the camera. I feel like I've gotten worse at that. They were preparing a ritual for a successful journey. So, they left without you? 
It looks like they didn't finish the ceremony. It's missing some offerings. Without them, their journey won't be successful. <laughs> That's what they get for leaving me behind. I guess so, we can finish it. Do you want me to finish the ceremony? Hmm. You know what? Yes, I do. What do we need? Two things. An animal offering and a sacred item. What should we start with? Let's start with... An animal offering, an I guess. animal offering. Where can we find something like that? Uh, we have to get creative. Can I get back to the food processing plant? I have an idea. I think so. Go behind the stage. There's a workshop there. I Do don't want to offer to catch a rat, though. There? Sort of. Hmm. What does sort of mean? There, in the bucket. Haha, <laughs> a toy sheep. Are you sure this will work? Don't worry, it's just about symbolism. Let's <laughs> look for that sacred item. Go to the bedroom, like you'll find it there. Why were there so many toys there? All the children grew up, and because of the radiation, no new ones were born. The youngest was Antek. When he turned 12, he became an adult. At 12? He shaved his head and put all the toys in one place for future children. Shaved his head? They shaved his head? As you might have noticed, the people here like rituals. <laughs> yeah. Alright, uh, what's this? Build a statue like it's no small thing. Don't get me wrong, I built all sorts of crap in my time. When I framed and roofed a summer villa for the chief of police in Oswo... Yeah, way why sim he nearly wet himself with admiration when he saw it i stayed out of the camp because of that unlike my predecessor who botched the job those forms i made outside got the gota for the underground bunkers that housed major speedy's partisans they took a bombing and still didn't bust but a statue what am i some kind of long chopping wood carver no i'm a carpenter damn it lucian might know his stuff about the gods but he doesn't know shit about wood well, I guess we're cursing. Although I suppose when the gods are involved, it's not—it's best not to make a fuss. Oh well, I guess I'll hack out that statue for him. Is Lucian the priest slash pastor, which would make him our dad and Eva's dad? So. In the bucket. Is Eva? No, I already got that. Stop breaking game. Is Eva actually our older sister? <laughs> that's that's kind of messed up though what the hell happens but still kind of cool but kind of messed up not because she's messed up or because we're messed up but because like what happened now straight ahead okay what am I looking for my hairpin what does the hairpin look like my father carved it in the shape of a bison. At least that's what he said it was. This is <laughs> where I last saw it. Somewhere in here. Look, some glasses. Nothing to say about that? Okay. Is your hairpin here? I can't find it. I guess we'll have to find something else instead. Uh -oh. How about the ring on the draw? Oh, it's the ring with the red gem that the dude yes, wanted from Mrs. What's-Her-Name. You just have to bless it, but that's not going to be difficult. Bless it looks it. like we have everything. We can go back to the altar now. Hold on, hold on. I want to keep exploring. I wonder what happened to that hairpin. Maybe they took it. No. They knew how important it was to me. Maybe I'm that's sure why they took it. If, they th if you disappeared or went missing and they thought she was gone, left without her. Oh man, that's such a sucky thing to do. E K? Those are my initials. Oh, this is Did where she lived? That? No, Antek carved it for me. He got such a talking to after. What does the K stand for? Mm, I don't remember. What was Lucian's last name again? Lucian... I don't remember. I think it started with a K. I think it started with a K.
Oh, there's a way through over there. What's this? Great Velas, grant me the gift of motherhood. Let me savor the sight of my own child as he learns to walk and talk, as he grows and supports me and my husband in our old age. I tried treating myself with primrose oil, flaxseed oil, and chastewood extract. An herbalist friend gave me a mixture of, my, of ladies' mantle, yarrow, rue leaves, yellow, melit, melilot, lavender, calamus root, marigold flower, hops, and rose hip. Nothing helped. The years go by and I fear my womb will soon be barren. I vow if I am granted offspring, I will raise them to revere and worship you to the end of their days. You are my last hope. Stop praying to this fake god that Lucian made up. People are so blind. Desperate people, I guess. Okay, how do we bless this ring? Put the offerings in the bowls. Now Boom. bless the items and the ritual will be complete. How do I do that? How do I do that? Just say a few words. Something profound. The gods like that. <laughs> how about... I love this. No matter how dark the night, the new day sun Oh, will what rise. his son used to say. Yeah, his, that his works. Son, his mom used to say to him. I think son. we did it. Their journey should be successful now. All right. Wherever they went. I can't believe they Thank left her behind. For what me. the heck? I mean, I guess if they Since like couldn't find her. Here, and the people from that recording move here. Did you recognize any of them? By Clutian? That scientist? I don't remember anyone like that. Oh. At least I don't think I do. Hmm. Okay. I'm glad that we So maybe I'm wrong, ritual. but I don't know. Their journey should be safe now. But that Maybe people mentioned Lucian's, so, like, he should have been here. She should have seen him if she grew up here. This is so weird. So she got lost, gets locked in this control room. They leave without her. What's this? And what's here? Something isn't right about this place. What do you mean? I just don't remember being here. What do you mean? this pop up after she disappeared how long has she been gone exactly the tree it's the same as the one in your mom's drones that's Lucian Colinda yes it's Kay and there's the Monica they look like they were friends she changed she definitely got older he grew his hair out and became a priest. My husband to be? Oh, that is one cute baby. Oh um, no. That's that's us, isn't it? So us. Your photo fits in this space. But that doesn't make any sense. It would mean that the baby is you? Yep. So Lucian is our dad. Ain't that lovely? Well, welcome to the horrible fathers club, Shimon. I can't imagine what you're going through then that Lucian is your father. He will never be my father. And I don't want to talk about it. Okay, just Yeah, okay. So is Is Dominica our mom? I'm going under you a different must name. Be your father's. Oh, I mean, Lucian's study. I leave this Who's with you. When the time save? comes, it is the gods who will judge my action. I will stand before them. I will look them in the eyes and I will not blink because I know that one cannot have a higher purpose than devoting their whole lives to saving their loved ones. Who? Also, did Dominica and him have a child before everything that happens, I'm assuming? My dear friends, now that's not it. Bracha i siostry. Yes, much better. Bracha i siostry. Recently, there have been many events that have left us at a loss for words. Things that lack 
any rational explanation. Recoveries from illness that seemed impossible. The appearance of farm animals that were thought to be extinct. I have long believed that someone has been watching over us. Still, I was afraid to share my thoughts. That is, until now. Lucian! Fate has brought us here, to the land of Veles, the Slavic god of water and the underworld. Lucian, Obiad. Give me a moment, please. You know I get nervous before these things. I'm sorry, just hurry up, it's getting cold. So, is Dominica our mom, but under a different name? Brothers and sisters, we do not know when we shall leave this bunker. We must fend for ourselves, and it warms my heart to see the spirit of camaraderie among e us each and every day. Yet events have transpired that are hard to explain rationally. Laurent Pien Pienai Pienaizek found a new tunic when his old one could no longer be patched up. This Banu Chawa found a new hoe after her old one broke, and Jedrek Pletkow returned to health when we thought when we never knew what afflicted him or how to cure it. Sorry, my neck hurts. Uh, this is the longest recording session I've done. The list goes on. I have the feeling that someone is watching over us, and recently he has given us a sign. Fate's tangled path has brought us to the kingdom of Veles, the Slavic god of water of the underworld, yet also of song and poetry. I feel it is he who is behind all of these marvels. He is giving us signs so that we will believe. Let us erect an altar and statue to worship him so that we may win his favor and his aid. I can't decide if he actually believes this nonsense or if he made it up to convince people to follow him. There's a computer. Very nice. 